she looks so clean on camera. Welcome back to another video. It's a beautiful day in California. The rain's finally stopping. Partly cloudy today, a little bit windy. And gonna wash the daily filthy ass Mustang. Got bugs for days. All on my front bumper. So, gonna get that off the car today. Um, as you probably seen in my last video, I gotta take off this tent as well. Um, technically I don't have to do it until I actually get the ticket in the mail. So, if I get pulled over again because of it, I just show them that I already got a ticket for it. And the worst that they can do is tell me to take it off and then I'll do it. But, so I'm just gonna leave it. He also told me I have to take this off, which is pretty annoying. He said it has to come up to this line right here. And I guess every windshield has that line to show that's as high as the tank can go. Or as far up as the tank can go and mine goes way down here. So, when I do have to take off the tent and get it written off, I'll have to remove that front strip as well. Still have the missing fox cap. And it's been raining a lot, no issues with that. No water's getting into the actual trunk, so that's good. And yep, my car is just filthy. Dirty, dirty, dirty. Tire letters are dirty. So I'm just gonna take my time, clean it all up, and I'll get back to you. today thought I would try it out just came out turtle wax wheel and tire cleaner uh, it's working pretty good you see all the brown coming off the tire we'll see how it actually cleans up the rim but I mean that's pretty damn good it was literally like four bucks at Walmart so can't really beat that See how good this works. Just scrub the tire and letters look filthy. Wow, that is really good. Letters are clean. This is like the best product Turtle Wax has ever made. Usually their stuff's not that good, but Holy shit, this right here? Wow. Here's like a before, how the, te the letters looked and how they're looking now. Some good shit, Turtle Wax, some good shit. So, as much as I would wanna baby my car, it's not babied. And this shows it right here. filthy and as much as I would want to keep it clean all the time you know I can't it's my daily so it's hard to keep clean a lot of people say it's clean but you know when I see it like this I'm like far from that but you know team not babied I see you on Instagram Thank you. 
the car. So what I use is this Adams Polishes interior detailer. Uh, works real good. Doesn't have like a fragrance or anything. It's like a neutral smell, which I prefer because I don't want my car to like be overpowered with the scent. And just use a microfiber towel. This stuff, you can spray it on leather. You can spray it plastics, metals, everything in the car. And it won't mess it up. And this stuff works wonders. So I'm going to start cleaning right now with this. And then I'll get back to you guys. Clean interior. Vacuumed it already. Wiped everything down. looking good for a six-year-old car this stuff's really good though I like Adams polishes but not all their products I usually just buy this one and their other detailer for the exterior for the paint those are the only products I really like from those everything else I thought was just okay but yeah good people All right guys, so that's gonna wrap up today's video. Um, sorry about the wind, if there's any issues with that, with the audio. Um, just clean the car, quick update about what I gotta do with the window tint. I'll probably make a video, cause I'll just be removing it myself when that time comes. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. Um, it's my day off, so I'm just gonna hang out and relax. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Subscribe if you haven't already, like the video, leave some comments down below, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.